What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Nothing except learning about place value and numbers. This video is about my version of the card game called War. It will help you to understand place value and to say and compare big numbers. Now I know this is all a little bit educational, but don't worry, I will go back to talking about poo and heavy metal next week. To play this game, you will need a deck of UNO cards. You can remove all of the special cards, so you just have numbers 0 to 9. You'll also need a friend to play with. I've got Mrs O. Ooh. Split the deck into two, one for each player. Level 1. The Basics. Each player draws three cards and places them in the hundreds, tens and ones places. Turn over the cards and whoever has the highest number wins and keeps all of the upturned cards. Easy peasy, mac and cheesy. Remember to say the numbers out loud for practice. Level 2. Highest or lowest. This time, before you turn over your cards, take it in turns to choose whether you're playing for the highest or lowest number. Level 3. Preview. Once you have drawn your cards, the first player chooses who should turn over their cards first. I will turn over my own cards this time. Then the first player decides whether to play for the highest or lowest. You can strategize a bit here, depending on whether you think you've got a high or a low number. Level 4. Switch. This is the same as the previous levels, but each player has the option to switch the places of two of their cards. This means that even if you're losing, you have the chance to get ahead. Perhaps not. Level 5. Bigger Numbers. This game can be played with bigger and bigger numbers. It's not just good maths practice, it's good for speaking too, as you say numbers like 123,456 or 987,654,321. If you don't have UNO cards, you can do this with regular playing cards. Just remove the tens, jacks and kings, and use the queens for zeros. If you don't have regular playing cards, just create your own number cards. So, I hope you enjoyed that, and I uh, hope that you'll have a go at this game with your grown-ups at home, and learn a little bit about place value. And, and big numbers. And maybe war, but probably not, probably not war, because, well, it, it's not really got, not really very much to do with war at all, actually. <laughs>